it's too good to spoil right now. What's going on members of the Burger Empire? Brian here for Body by Burgers. Good God, did that feel good to say. I know it's been a couple weeks since I've put out a video, but let me explain. So we'll give you a bit of a backstory here. Hang on to the end of this video, guys, because I do have something kind of special for you. But I got to explain some things, where I've been, what I'm doing, and things going forward. One thing that I've realized that's kind of unfortunate about the health and fitness industry is that it's incredibly cutthroat. Now, what I mean by that, and it's not necessarily a bad thing, but what I mean by that is there's people out there that don't want to take my advice serious because of the way I look. I know I'm, I'm overweight, whatever, I'm working on that. But the unfortunate part about the health and fitness industry, unless you either A, look the part, or B, are someone with previous experience or previously looked the part, very few people take you seriously. Despite me having or had a personal training certificate, it's since expired, me, and, and despite me literally every single chance I get to the, the, this free time is actually studying health and fitness and weight loss and becoming more of an expert in the field, people don't take you serious. And I realize that. And there's a couple videos out there that I put out that I had posted to other sites and sources to kind of get more exposure, see if it's going to grow the channel. And in fact, it ended up hurting the, the channel. I've come to a realization that the channel really hasn't grown at all for about six months. And that's not what I want. What I want is to be able to provide content for you guys, more content, have the channel grow, and actually have this take over as what I do. So I took a step back. I realized that maybe the educational side of health and fitness isn't where I should be at this point. Maybe the way direction I should go is more of a vlog style um, channel where I show you guys my workouts, where I tell you what I did for a workout, why I did that for the workout, and show you guys that I do practice what I preach. This channel is going to go through a bit of a transformation much like myself. Imagine that. But what I'm going to try and drive for more is I'm going to do more, like I said, vlogging style videos where I show you my workouts. I'm going to do more comedic style videos, ones that aren't so serious, um, kind of like the ones that I did way back when, when I did the, uh, the Total Beef, uh, where I was like, eating the burgers and kind of doing the workouts because I had a lot of fun with those. Uh, maybe you might see some more like skit style videos where, you know, maybe I poke fun at myself or I poke fun at, um, you know, particular ideologies or um, just different things. I want to bring some more comedy back into it because I really do feel as though people enjoyed the comedy aspect that I had. Um, when I very first started the channel, and I really did kind of get away from, from that. Um, there was a couple times where I did have some videos like bulking on a budget, where it was comedy. Um, but I kind of want to get back into that. And the big thing that I'm working on, I mean, I want to do food challenges because I kind of want to do the things that I enjoy watching on YouTube. Part of the reason that I got into doing YouTube was because of these things that I enjoyed watching. And I thought, hey, I, I can do that. Um, you know, whether it's going to be volume of food, whether it's going to be hot food, whether it's going to be gross tasting food, I want to do more of that kind of thing as well. I've mentioned this before and I'll mention it again, really working hard with a buddy of mine. He's got another YouTube channel. It's called Hebrew Hulk. Go check him out. We've got some pretty exciting collaborations planned. 
I'm not going to give away too, too much about it simply because it's too good to spoil right now. The unfortunate part about the fitness industry is that it's really cutthroat. It's pretty much black and white. If I'm not walking around at 8% body fat, jacked as a motherfucker, people won't take me serious because it looks as though I'm not taking myself serious. But I promise you I am. And in that two weeks that I've been gone, not making videos, I've been focusing on myself. I've been practicing what I've been preaching. I've gone to the gym nine straight days and I've only missed one workout in these uh, like two weeks that I haven't done videos. I've ramped up my cardio. I've applied to my workouts what I had said about when you should be doing cardio. In fact, I've done actually a little bit less weight training than normal. Really, really focused on my portion sizes and my diet. And I have a big announcement to make. One of my little goals that I had along here has officially been achieved. Now my impossible goal doesn't seem so impossible. My impossible goal was to be under 300 pounds by the end of April, and I feel like I'm kind of on track for that. It's still gonna be pretty tough to do, because I do have a long way to go. Officially, from my heaviest weight, I have lost exactly 60 pounds. And since going public with my journey, I am just shy of 40 pounds total from the time that I've gone public with my journey. So I'm sitting at 39 pounds loss total. I have a little printout from the scale right here to prove that. It's got to focus in. So there you are. 23.4 or 23.4 pounds, I wish. 323.4 pounds. So in five weeks time, I have to lose another 23.4 pounds. We're looking at about four pounds a week. Possible? Some may say. But I'm here to do the impossible. I'm here to change the channel. I'm here to show you guys that I can do this as opposed to just preach, preach, preach. I'm here to prove that I got this. So bear with me. Please be patient. The videos are probably going to be uploaded pretty sporadically because, again, I still have a full time job that I got to deal with. Fucking bug in here. It's unfortunate, but like I said, I want to get back into it. As you can see, my eyes seem kind of bagged, but um, I have faith that uh, the new direction that I'm going to take the channel, the channel is going to grow. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you like the video, please hit that like button. It goes a long way. If you haven't subscribed already, I'm still going to retain that 100 subscriber challenge for you guys. I'll put that link right about there. And until next time, everybody, burger power.